Hey, how you doing? Adam Buxton here. I'm the host of Bug. It's a bi-monthly video showcase at the BFI in London. That's on Earth. And uh, right now, I'm going to read some YouTube comments. So at the time Dennis made this, he was a 23-year-old um, producer in an ad agency in New York, BBDO, and he single-handedly created this video as a means of um, showing off not only his mad computer skills with a Z, uh, but also demonstrating some of the features available to him on his Apple Mac. He was basically trying to get the attention of his peers there. The girl in the video is not Bird and the Bee singer uh, Inara George, but it's actually an actress called Larkin Clark. Uh, there should be a link hovering around here somewhere. If you haven't seen the video, you should check it out. If you have, let's check out some of the comments that the video has received over the years. The creative Apple geek, you'd think that he'd be a little biased, <laughs> says, very awesome, five out of five. That's how um, Apple geeks speak. Um, the Catherine Nell says, wonderful taste in music, beautiful gal and creativity. You are going to go places. That's a nice positive comment uh, for YouTube. You don't often get those. <laughs> um, the dude extreme, he's an extreme dude, says, whoa, this video supersedes beauty. This is indeed ravishing. From the aesthetics and user interface of the Mac OS X to the acoustically pleasing melody, even the woman's face of this video embraces the enchanting radiance of creation itself. Beyond impressive, enlightening. The Dude Extreme. The Dude Extreme would have been happy with that comment. This is what he would have looked like as he was writing it. Uh, there's the Dude Extreme. <laughs> Don Yu Huan says, damn, she's beautiful, talking about Larkin Clark there in the video, and I'm sure she's narcissistic about that fact too. <laughs> <laughs> beautiful women. <laughs> Miss Garcia Ridge says, uh, it looks like the girl possesses typical American teenage facial features. Mm, we have studied many women from your planet. And this one possesses typical American facial features. <laughs> Interesting. Pankster, 1973, is sent off on a reverie by that comment and says, Mmm, facial. <laughs> nice. Nice comment. DRFT Bling 711 says, Too bad Max are gay. And everyone I know that has one is a pretentious trendy fag. I've never been called trendy before. <laughs> Thank you very much. Sean, 1998-16, says, A PPC would froze if they tried this on there. <laughs> Rico's Rebel. <laughs> Rico's Rebel says, One minute to one minute, one second, it changes from Mac Tiger to Leopard. <laughs> Uh. That's what that emoticon means. Uh. And this sparks off a whole big debate about the switch in operating system that occurs in the video. I know a lot of you out there were disturbed and uh, frightened by it, and uh, there are many comments underneath the video about it. Jay Chris says, no, they opened Photoshop at one minute, one second. They were in 10.5 from the beginning. The dock is a 10.5 feature. James W. Frost says, no, they were in Tiger 10.4, and then at 1.1, at which point they switch to Leopard. You can see the menu bar change, for starters. The translucent menu bar was a feature of 10.5 up until 10.5.2, when you could make it opaque again. The dock has been in OS 10 since the beginning. Get your facts straight. <laughs> Four people, uh, glad to hear James getting the facts straight there. However, Palouse is incandescent with rage about Jay Chris's comments. Jay Chris, you're a fucking idiot! 
The dock has been in Mac OS X since 10.0.0 in the year 2000. It's an eight-year-old feature. He started in Tiger, then got Leopard. If you knew anything about Mac OS X, then you'd be able to tell. The rectangular dock is Tiger, the glass one is Leopard. <laughs> uh, Gabriel, 25 Gatons at this point, says, Mac costs nine, 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 nine pounds. Best ever PC costs 100 pounds. Go suck Harry Balls, Mac fans. You can't take the truth. Yes, they can fit in a evil lobe. That's what only matters, right? Mac Fook is your greatest boss. <laughs> yes, they can fit in evil lobe, but Mac Fook is your greatest boss. Get fresh replies, why don't you go suck on your own balls, dickhead? <laughs> Gabriel, 25 Gatons, replies, I would if I could, shitface, <laughs> but I can't reach. <laughs> so, obviously, I tried to suck my balls, obviously, but I can't reach. Mark, focus your great dad's balls. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs>